Ownership of copyright. The Harry Potter series were first published in 1997. The author of these books, J.K. Rowling, is known to have earned £506 million from the royalties. Like J.K. Rowling, the copyright to a work created by an individual belongs to the creator. However, if the work was made to create profit at a company, who would the copyright belong to? In the case of work done by an employee, the employer automatically becomes the copyright holder or the copyright holder is determined through the employment contract. Jack Kirby, a famous American cartoonist, created vivid characters with dynamic drawings and special effects. However, the copyright to the characters Jack Kirby created belongs to Marvel. After Jack Kirby died in 1994, Jack Kirby's heirs served Marvel with notices seeking to exercise their statutory termination rights. Because Jack Kirby was a freelancer from 1958 to 1963, they wanted the copyright to the characters created during this period. Marvel filed suit seeking a declaration that the Kirby heirs have no termination rights. The US District Court for the Southern District of New York ruled that the characters were works made for hire, therefore the copyright belonged to Marvel. If there isn't a separate contract for work made for hire, then that work belongs to the company by principle. Even in the case of a freelancer, the court determined that an employment relationship was established. Works are created through subcontracts. When it's a work made through a contract between two companies, how will the copyright ownership be determined? If your company hired an advertising agency and produced an advertisement, unless it is clearly stated otherwise in the contract, the copyright belongs to the advertisement agency that created the ad. In such cases where the work is commissioned or produced by purchase order, then the creator of the work owns the copyright. Also, there are cases when several authors produce one work. Pororo is an animation character that children from all over the world love. It was created through a joint production between the two Korean companies, Ocon and Iconics Entertainment. Ocon created the original picture of Pororo the Little Penguin and Iconics took charge of the second half of the production, like making music, recording sounds and doing voiceover work, contributing to the completion of the character. Like Pororo, joint works created by two or more parties cannot be used separately. If the copyright share of the joint work must be transferred, or if an occasion to make a contract arises, the copyright co-owners must both agree. If you want to avoid inconvenience, then you can select a representative among the copyright co-owners and have that person manage the copyright. When the author and the copyright holder are different, the ownership of the copyright of the final work is decided through a contract between the author and the entrepreneur or between the authors. Therefore, authors and companies must pay attention to license agreements for use of copyrighted work so that the rights and the scope of the copyright are well protected.